Work is the learning and learning is the work. Now, before I give you the three takeaways for today's topic, I want to mention our sponsor, AppWork. Do you want to discover the innovative approach to enhancing team member performance and retention? You can do that at AppWork, where gamification and ratings bring out the best in your service team members. Learn more at appworkco.com. That's appworkco.com and see how they are transforming your operations with advanced business intelligence that can turn your data into powerful strategies. All right. I have always believed in the seamless integration of work and learning. In my head, those two things are one and the same, meaning that your training should be your work or predicated on work, real work that's happening real time. That should be the training. Figure out how to architect your learning and development department around that principle and around that philosophy where you're solving real world problems, real time. And that work is the training. So learning is the work and work is the learning. So if you do this, every single team member that you teach and train in your organization will embrace every single task as something that has high risk and high value, therefore high return. They're emotionally invested in that particular learning because it has an impact on the backside. That's the secret in my head, the secret to accelerating the pace of your education and your training in your organization is you do it with high value, high risk, high reward stuff. That imbues because it's emotionally loaded, right? It imbues the lesson in someone's mind when you do it with that kind of content. Now, how do you architect that? I'm not 100% sure, but I believe in my heart of hearts that there are platforms out there today that have already done this. And your organization in the multifamily space would simply have to adopt that kind of platform or create the platform yourself. <clears throat> now, when you do that, you are cultivating, this is kind of the second takeaway, you are cultivating a learning culture. And that when you when you get the collective nature of a learning culture, in other words, your entire organization is built around this real-time learning, you are really boosting, in my head, you're boosting the performance of your organization because you're getting real-time problems solved in real time and you're learning at the same time. So you're not sort of investing dead time on scenarios or uh, things that don't really matter to the outcome. You're investing in, in things that do matter to the outcome. And therefore, you're getting work done at the same time you're learning. So it really boosts the productivity in your organization. And this doesn't really, it, it not only works for your organization as a whole, and this is the third takeaway, it really, in my head, creates this incredibly strong bond between you and your organization and your new team member because they are trusted with big ticket items on day one as part of their learning. And so when they go home at night, they're like, you know what? I did some work today that impacted the ROI of my community real time. And I remember those lessons. They're imbued in my head because that click of a button that I made was the difference between making X dollars or losing X dollars or whatever the, the impact, the end impact is, the end result. That's useful in creating a bond between you and your organization and the new team member. They feel invested on day one. So steal this mindset. Look at work is the learning and learning is the work from day one in your organization. Take care. We'll talk to you again soon.